Czech Republic trying to put a stop to Team France's 2-0 campaign. They try to come out of this uh, first bout of pool play unscathed. It was a four-point loss to Japan for uh, Sarah Kumpotsova and company to start uh, their action. And I, I can guarantee you this will uh, this game will probably will be more difficult than even that one. <laughs> so 10-minute games, 12-second shot clocks. You know the deal by now. It's 3x3, y'all. Check in the blue, Le Blue in the white. How's that for you? Here we go. Nice move. Oh, and a splash cash. Victoria. Harry Oak. Straight to work. It's not Monday morning. Foul called on, uh, on Team France. But uh, quick two points for them. Start the game. Still uh, going to get a look at the, the men's team as well here in a bit. Good guard matchup here, Kumpotsova. 3x3 U18 MVP against the reigning U23 Nations League MVP. Harry O. So it was a 22 to six win for Team France over Mongolia to get uh, their pool play started. And obviously, they're they're pretty they pretty dang on strong on the inside. Kone opens up a three nothing lead. Thank our official uh, sponsors, founding partner Nike, our official timekeeper T. So, our global partner Wilson. None of this would be be possible without them, and, and this definitely would not be possible without the LOC. So, uh, from from the voice especially, thank you very much. Appreciate you. That one out of bounds. Final game in Pool C. Czech trying to pull off a big upset against the number three team in the world. Kumpotsova guarding Manye to Kone. Oh, Kone. She missed that layup. Usually you can count that. Kumpotsova takes the screen, gives the rock up. That shot not, not shot in time to prevent the shot clock violation. So it'll go back over to Le Bleu in Le White. Oh, nice, nice cut and easy score, Victoria. Oh, but then uh, Check gets on the board the best way that they can with a two ball. Now Harry O, the crossover, tough shot as she flipped that one up. See her grabbing that right thigh a little bit. Might have stepped, uh, had an awkward step Check underneath. She's all right, though. Check starting to move the ball. They get it to the sniper, Krumpotsova, but she couldn't hit it. Harry O, step back. Oh, oh. She got, uh, yeah, definitely, <laughs> as Noah Lazarus says, a little jelly on it. It had to be jelly, because jam don't shake like that. Another look at it. Oh, the touch. The flip. The beauty. 5-2. Le Bleu. Oh, nice pass. So Czech Republic can do that. How consistent can they be? Six to three. 
Very little margin for error in a game like this against Team Front. You got to do it right and do it often. Victoria. Nice behind the back. Good move. Somebody get her GPS. She was lost. Four point game. Oh, run through. Floater. Uh uh. Here you go. Open like a double click. And she connects. Oh. Has a foul after the good move from Ruskova. So another look, Victoria puts on the brakes, turns around, kisses it off the glass. As Team France is in control early in the action. And again, Team France, they uh, edge China this year, the U23 Nations League. So they, uh, they are the reigning champs. They won five of their eight stages they played in. And you can see why. Same four that you see on the court are the four that, that uh, competed this year. And the second edition of the U23 Nations League, which is helping uh, develop the younger 3x3 players, preparing them for the Olympics and multi-sport competitions. Free throws made. And the two-pointer is missed, but Kone doing it inside. 9-5, France with the advantage. Some good passing underneath Opochinska. But a little bit outmatched as Kone gets yet another score. And Harry Oak, she's caught in a bad position. Dodged the bullet, though. Shot was missed anyway. Now Harry Oak, she's got space to operate. Oh, she just pauses for a moment and then explodes to the rim. Made it look easy on the way. Six oh four officially left uh, left in this game. We are past the midway mark here, day two. Twenty games for four days straight. Forty teams. Twenty nine countries represented. As uh, Xi'an plays host to this inaugural FIBA three x three U twenty three World Cup. After this one, we'll, uh, we'll get our first look at Uganda. Pool A against uh, Romania. One of nine games still left today, Victoria. Yeah, easy foul call. Glenn to it with the whistle. No Free throws missed. Victoria comes up with it. Rocking the long braids. And misses on a follow attempt. Five forty three left and France is giving it to Czech Republic. Twelve five. So Manye gets it over to Victoria. Victoria, victorious on the pull up J. Eight point lead for Team France in a first of 21 game. We'll see if this one gets reaches the 10 minute limit at the pace that France is on now. That ain't likely. Krupotsova forced it up, had to, to, uh, to beat the shot clock. She hits nothing, so a violation it is. And uh, over to Harry Owen company. So they get back in business. They got this thing down to an exact science. Money pulls up. 
Manye couldn't uh, couldn't couldn't find the mark that time. So Check will take take over. And again, Check suffered a 15 to 19 loss to Japan. That was a hard foul by Harry O. Unintentional, but how about Harry Ova? Staying with it. Oh, not uh, not Harry Ova. Excuse me, Ruzkova. The 19-year-old. Tough finish. Again, won silver at the U18 World Cup in Chengdu, 2017. And the free throw is good. Makes it a three-possession game. So 13-7. Kone missed the point-blank range. Quick trigger. Fire the blank. Ruskova. Now we'll have to defend the lightning quick Harry O. Harry O, jab step. Oh, just froze her with the head fake. Oh, nice move. But uh, unable to be finished. Hiroshkova. A little quiet offensively in this one. Czechs gonna need an explosion if they want to get back in this game. It's a seven-point basketball game, but Harry O. Willing and Dillon. Kropotsova. Good move. And uh, Hiroshkova couldn't get it to go. Now she got a D up. That's a tough assignment right there. That's like, oh, but Kone missed it. So. Credit Hiroskova for the D. Hiroskova turns around, but it's waved off because it wasn't clear. Got to get beyond that two-point arc. So, uh, yeah, the shot was good. But uh, waved off again. She didn't clear it. Stays 14-7. Harry O just crazy wide open. Check the fell asleep defensively. Let's we'll see if they awaken on offense. Not on that possession. TV timeout. 15 to 7 game. 350 left in the final pool C play. Pool C game for the ladies. It's France it's continuing their domination. Watch these, uh, watch these ladies start with a 13-game win streak in their Nations League uh, campaign. They looked unbeatable, but uh, China proved that they were not unbeatable in, uh, in Hyderabad. But China wasn't able to accumulate as many tour points as Team France, so that's how France was able to, uh, to win the U23 Nations League. Kone, count it up, count it up, count it. 16-7. As they are now five, within five points, putting this one on ice. But uh, still can't fall to sleep on a team that has Sarah Kumpotsova. Any, any player that uh, that can score 17 alone in a in a first of 21 game, she makes the free throw. And they will get possession. Technical was called on on fronts. If you were wondering, possession to uh, check as well. Let's see what they do with it. They got only two left on the shot clock, and they force it up and out of bounds. Ball back over to the French. Oh, Harry O. Nice pass. Oh, Victoria. Oh, she crossed her, and she didn't even look both ways. Victoria. 
10 point game. As Victoria bottoms up from two range, 20 to eight. Hurry up, she can end it. Foul white. Seventh foul on, on France. Another look. Victoria tickling the twine there. He he he. <laughs> 20 to 8. And two shots for uh, the newest. The newest member of, of Instagram, Anna Hirschkova. She makes the first of two. But uh, her squad has only been able to manage half of what France has put out there. Hario passes up the layup. France trying to accumulate as, as many points as they have as they can. Yeah, and then Victoria, you see her teammates coming to talk to her and saying, "Hey, with the with the game already in the bag, we wanted to get 22 just in case of a tiebreaker. And a little bit of a rookie mistake, but a win is a win is a win." 